Hi guys! In this video, I will be showing you how to create two simple but elaborate buns. They look really fancy, but they're actually not as hard to create as they might look. The first look features a fancy pulled back voluminous bun. And the second look is a side updo with lots of intricate curls to make it red carpet appropriate. Lately, I've been really obsessed with the Nexus Color Share Shampoo and Conditioner. As you can tell, I have colored hair from about mid shaft downwards, and this is great at locking in my toner, my hair dye, making sure the color lasts, but also moisturizing and conditioning my hair. So if you have colored hair and you're looking for a new line, I highly recommend you try these out. To begin the first look, I am leaving out a couple of sections of hair just framing my face and with the rest of my hair, I am twisting it slightly, folding it up and holding this down in place, squished right on top of my head wherever I want the bun to be and then grabbing bobby pins with my right hand and securing it down wherever necessary. So once the bun starts to take shape, at this point you can decide how you want the bun to look and how you want to define it. So I decided that I want it to be a bit more neat, so I'm just grabbing the curls however they're hanging, twisting them in the natural direction and pinning that down for more shape and definition into the bun. This is optional, you can just grab random pieces and secure it down in place. It will look great anyways because this is meant to be a more effortless and kind of messy updo. At this point, it should look something like this. And I'm just going to grab a small section of hair from the side of my face that I left out from earlier on, twist this back in the direction of the curl, and pin it right down over the bun. So I like the look of having the loose ends hanging out, but again, that's totally optional. So twist back all of the loose hair from both sides and you should end up with something that looks like this. Feel for any weird ends that are poking out or anything that's sitting funny. For example, I found this section that was hanging way too low for my liking, so I just grabbed it, twisted it, pinned it right up. Once you're happy with the look, we are done with hairstyle number one. To prevent frizz, flyaways, and to help maintain the shine in your hair, spray it down with the Dove Style & Care Extra Hold Hairspray. This is great for fancy looks like this that require the maintenance and extra holding power while still allowing your hair to look and feel really natural. To create the side updo, I am going to divide my hair kind of on a diagonal from my upper left temple down to my right ear and pin the section up and out of the way for the time being. Twist your hair slightly and pull it into a low side ponytail. Once you've done this, take your elastic band and wrap it around the ponytail a couple of times and on the very last loop, don't pull your hair all the way through to create a small loop. Stick two of your fingers through this loop and pull the loose ends of your ponytail right the way through to create a second loop that interlinks with the first. Hold this down in place and adjust it until you like the look and secure it in place with a couple of bobby pins. At this point, we can release the upper sections of hair that we had pinned up and allow everything to fall down naturally. Take a random section and backcomb it right at the roots slightly for extra volume. Brush out the very top layer so it still looks neat and twist it in the direction of the curl so that it sits naturally and pin it down in place when you're happy with how it looks. Do this with the rest of your hair and you should have something that looks like this. I'm just adjusting the curls to make sure they sit naturally and are locked down in place. Once you are happy with the look, we will again set it in place with the Dove Style & Care Extra Hold Hairspray. Here again are the final looks for both of the elaborate buns. Both of these looks were surprisingly easy to master and they look amazing for any formal event you might have coming up. 
Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys!